two children were transformed into saints in just two short years after Our Lady appeared to them. Can Our Lady perform this same transformation for you and me? Stay with me to hear more. Howdy, and welcome to America Needs Fatima. My name is Adrian Fonseca, and before we get going, I want to let you know that you can have this. Yeah, this right here, a full color Catholic magazine delivered to your front door by clicking your screen right here. And if you want to learn more about this incredible Catholic magazine, or well, you're gonna wanna stick around to the end of the video, and there, I'm going to tell you all about it. Okay, now let's talk about how you and I can emulate Saints Jacinta and Francesco and become saints in just two years. In 1917, Our Lady of Fatima appeared to three shepherd children who at the time could only be considered ordinary children who played and danced in the fields. But one day, Our Lady appeared to them and their lives were radically transformed particularly those of Francesco and Jacinta Marto. Those two were siblings who died a few short years after the apparitions. It's commonly agreed that one of the children, Francesco, advanced spiritually in one week, more than many saints advanced in one year. But how were Jacinta and Francesco so strikingly transformed into saints? Well, to answer that question, let's return to our story. When Our Lady appeared, the children described her as a lady more brilliant than the sun, spreading a light clearer and more intense than a crystal glass full of crystalline water, crossed by the rays of the most ardent sun. The children were so close that they stood in the light surrounding her. And later in the apparition, Our Lady actively gave the light to the children. In Sister Lucia's words, she opened her hand for the first time communicating to us a light so intense like reflections from her hands that penetrated into our chest in the innermost parts of our souls, making us see ourselves in God. God was this light, making us see ourselves more clearly than in the best mirror. Now, how amazing is that? God's light radiated onto them. It seems Our Lady wanted to share God's light because in her second apparition, the same thing happened after she told the children, Do not be dismayed. I will never forsake you. My Immaculate Heart shall be your refuge and the road leading you to God. Now, those children weren't saintly to begin with, and they weren't fervent devotees to the rosary because they wanted to get back to their games. They invented an abbreviated version of the rosary. One would call out, Hail Mary, and the other one would reply, Holy Mary, and so forth. Until Our Lady's first apparition, when she promised to take Lucia and Jacinta to heaven, but to obtain the same grace, Francesco had to pray many rosaries. And so he did. Only after receiving the light of God could the children endure great suffering. For example, they were given the virtue and the grace to endure a vision of hell that was given to them by Our Lady to show the seriousness of sin. Lucia later would say that they would have died of terror had Our Lady not already promised to take them to heaven. Later, they endured imprisonment when they refused to reveal the secrets that Our Lady gave to them. They held fast despite threats of being boiled alive and burning oil. These are only a couple examples of these children's sufferings, for God's sake. And I could go on and on, uh, but these changes that Our Lady brought about were extraordinary and far beyond their capacity to achieve on their own. Their desire to serve God increased suddenly, as did their hatred for sin, in a quicker way than the usual uphill struggle that you and I experience. Their exposure to the light of Our Lady, which is the light of God, gave them the grace to become saints. Which leads me to this. Why wouldn't we ask Our Lady for this same grace? Although we're not gifted with physically seeing Our Lady shine with the light of God, we can, in a sense, with the eyes of prayer, you and I can ponder in our hearts 
the mystery of our Lord, whom Scripture describes as light coming into the world through Our Lady. And if we do this with a sincere desire to seek God above all things, then Our Lady will give us whatever grace we need to become the saints that we are called to be. Perhaps this is a foretaste of how Our Lady intends to change the world through the triumph of her Immaculate Heart. So let's ask Saint Jacinta and Francesco to transform us and to grant us the same gifts that they received. We must confidently ask, knowing that Our Lady can grant it to us if only we are willing to ask and correspond to her grace. Okay, now on to that Catholic magazine that I mentioned at the beginning. This Catholic magazine is called Crusade Magazine. We call it that because we print this magazine to help us all in our crusade against the devil and our march towards heaven. Crusade Magazine is full of news articles, Catholic wisdom from the saints, and hundreds of stories of the Catholic faith, just like the one that we talked about today. Each of our Child of Mary members gets a subscription to Crusade Magazine as one of their gifts when they join. So if you'd like to have a gorgeous and inspiring Catholic magazine delivered to your front door, well, make sure you take a look at the description down below, or you can go ahead and click right there. There, yeah. And as soon as you sign up, we will start sending issues of Crusade to your front door, and we will also send you a beautiful metal lapel pin and have a traditional Catholic mass said in your name for your intentions every day of the year and when you join us as a child of Mary today. Okay, that's all I have for you today. May God bless you and Mary Immaculate keep you under her mantle. God love you. Thanks for watching. To save souls, there needs to be more Fatima focused content on YouTube. If you agree and you want to help me make more videos, please join our special Child of Mary group. As a child of Mary, you'll get a beautiful Fatima pin, plus inspiring reports on America Needs Fatima work to save souls. Click the link in the description below to learn more and become a child of Mary. God love you.